Prakash, would you say the confidence that Hardik Pandya got from captaining the Gujarat Titans is now showing in his game? Well, I'm sure that that's, uh, that's got something to do with it. I mean, as you get responsibility and you deliver well in, in whichever endeavor of life you may be, uh, it's bound to tell in, in everything you do. And you could see that, whether it was in the field, whether it is the way he's looking after his body. I mean, you look at Hardik mm -hmm. Pandya on the cricket field and you can see that he is very, very aware of everything that's happening both to him and to the game. And I think he played a very big role, as I said earlier, in this, in this partnership. I think his... Uh, his being fit in all formats is a massive plus for India. Uh, India just need to make sure that, that we're able to look after him well and that he stays fit for a long, long time. Charu, would you say Hardik is back at his best? Absolutely. And I agree with Prakash that he needs to be very, very well looked after, which means, of course, we need to also somehow follow a sensible rotation policy, which is not easy, mind you, because, you know, if you lose matches and the A team is not there, you know, there will be criticism saying, why wasn't he playing? But we know that there's a lot of cricket going on now. If he's a three-format three player, all three-format player, then he's going to get burnt out very quickly. So India does need to look after him. But, you know, unlike uh, Rishabh Pant, where wicket keepers tend to get largely injured on their fingers and, mm. you know, lit around their hand, uh, but Hardik is a bowler as well. Now, a bowling, a fast bowling all-rounder, uh, and he has shown it in the past, is much more prone to injuries that can be career-threatening or take a few yeah. months away. So we need just to make sure that, that the workload on Hardik is, is uh, bearable, especially with the bowling. Um, can he fit into a team just as a batsman? He's shown he possibly can. But if he can also bowl the way he's been bowling and he has this knack for taking wickets, then of course he's priceless.